It is Maryland who controls the tip. Deshaun Harris-Smith, the fabulous freshman, sets it all up. And here is Young, who is the head of the snake. Oh, an immediate block. Volleyball spike by Amore. Down for the Terps. She's 17% on the season from downtown. Williams comes up short. Maryland looking to run again and trying to go up double digits early. They will. Reese all alone, feeling himself at a timeout from Steve Peichel. 11 nothing start from Maryland. He gets double teamed and he's just spraying it out. Lob it up, Amore, patient, oh, had it blocked. Reese got him from behind. Simpson off the screen, pull up, no. Rutgers two for seven from three point range. Young lob it up, oh, Geronimo slam it down. It's another transition basket for the Maryland Terrapins and Jordan Geronimo running the wing. He was pointing the whole time. Jameer Young seeing it, making a play, throwing it up, and letting Geronimo go get it. Those hustle stats, they, they add up. And I feel like Kevin Willard is a big hustle stat believer. That's a nice finish for Cliff Memorial. He takes the elevator to the top floor. Julian Reese not matching his physicality. Much better pass. Michigan already with four turnovers. Trail by just two. Penn State has struggled to score, but Lilly gets an easy one and the foul. There, they like to go zone and then match up and just got Lilly cut right through the middle. Nobody picks him up and Ian Williams on Dunn. 12 to shoot for Burnett. Dump down. Reed. Oh, the spin cycle. He slams. Cut it in the foul. There the agility is on display. They're throwing it inside. He takes it to the middle. The footwork there to take him back. Baseline. Get some contact. You have to think that for Michigan. So Kern kicks. Dunn, Wahab, and Baldwin start this second half as well. Great feet. Oh, better recovery and a jump ball. Reed got a piece of it. It'll stay with Penn State. It's not good enough for Penn State, but well done by McDaniel getting downhill. Baldwin rattles home the three. How good has he been? Last five games, averaging 15-4 and almost 10 assists. To play in that ball screen, the traps are going to be there. Wahab now working on Howard. They'll keep Reed away. Try to keep him in the game. Two on the shot clock. Hicks has to fire. Oh, he fills it up. Zach Hicks. Money all night. Nice job defensively. Double teaming Garcia. Forcing him to give it up. And it will take it back nicely. Shot clock down at three. Pay. Nice spin and finish. Man. Obviously, his skill set offensively is what Tom Izzo is looking for. Jolt right now. How about that jolt? Off the bench and into the bucket for Xavier Booker. Coming off the bench to provide a great jolt is Xavier Booker. Corner oh. three. That is short for Mitchell. Hogard to Booker. Oh! The freshman coming to life early in Minneapolis. Pharrell Payne, another Twin Cities kid, throws it away. Holloman pushes. Fights hole. Wow, beautiful feed and finish. Timeout, Minnesota. To me, that's what he really focuses in on, but defensively rebounding with that size of the wing, I think he could be more effective. He almost got the steal there, and there is another dunk. And putting pressure on the Scarlet Knights, see if they can do that here against the Badgers. Kamari McGee, number four in white, has checked in. Storr feeling it early and make the Badgers 4-4 four of four from deep. A.J. Storr, I mean, just NBA range. And now he gets the steal to Young. Oh! Wow! Throws it down with the off right hand. Threw it down. Oh, man. I mean, look, he throws it ahead. He looks back, and he's like, whoever wants to jump, you're going to get put on a poster. And it's for sale at halftime. Great shooting the gap, coming up with the steal. And, oh, emphasis on the backside. Go ahead, Jameer Young. I see you. The second active leading score. I, I'm like you. I didn't expect that at either. Yeah, Connor Asesian is sending a message. I'm still here. That's right. Perkins sizing up that Ohio State defense. Perkins trying to get it going. Probe with the baseline. The drop off to Owen Freeman, the co-freshman of the year. And now Gale in the scramble against Dix. The tip won't go. Dembele able to secure. 
Sanford, McCaffrey, run to the floor, and the coach's son knocks it at 15. Play here at the target center. Iowa wanting to play fast in transition. Diamond up Patrick McCaffrey there. Coming up on 12 to play first half. Royal working against Sanford. Turns in the paint, count the bucket, and the foul. Poorly exchanged. Thornton looking back, it goes to Bonner. He'll try the three, and he'll hit. A weave to Perkins, now around the Freeman screen. Sanford, he'll launch quickly, and he'll hit. He's going to have to initiate offense, take care of the basketball, and contain Ace Baldwin, who has played at such a high level. We, we've seen greatness from Xavier Johnson at times, but he hasn't been consistent. He's going to have to be good tonight. Oh, That's pretty good. What a start. Khalil <laughs> Ware with the flush. Baldwin will reset with 15 to shoot. The lob to Lilly. Didn't oh, see it coming. Yeah. And Paco with the swat. Here's O'Boyle. Can't imagine that this is where they want the ball late clock with O'Boyle. Wow. And Hicks hits the three, and he's fouled by Leo. Penn State's got two players in the corner. Now they set, situate that. Hicks was one of those two. He comes up top for the wow. three. Banks it home! And a chance for one more. Seven to shoot. It's Renew at the top, driving on Mitchell. Dies back on. Wow. There's Leo! The Bloomington kid delivers for Indiana. Here's Dunn. Puff Johnson for the win. Short. And Anthony Leal's game winner sends his school on in the Big Ten tournament. He hit at Ohio State. And an ace ball win just turning and watching. Doesn't get a block out. Honestly, not a great shot for Indiana out of the timeout. But Anthony Leal just going. No blockout, and what a play for a guy who is the consummate teammate. All his teammates love him, and he has played his role, given them a lift with his shooting. But man, what a hustle 50-50 play to seal the deal for Indiana. And look at the bench. They can't believe it. And now Smith. Smith turned in the corner, accelerating to the rim. Edie there to turn it up. Wow, looks like Hall and Cooper got their feet tangled up. Well, Zach Eady was the beneficiary of some bodies laying on the floor. Smith. Dropping it off to Eady. Walker swarming inside. They're going to count that bucket and Tyson Walker with the foul. Flat. Watch, you'll see Walker slap Eady's forearm right there. Doesn't matter. Throwing out early comparisons to Jaron Jackson when he got here. That's hard to live up to. Great point. Oh, what a shot from Lance Jones from deep. He's first personal. Well, you see uh, Tyson Walker trying to read the play, and he got caught. Mason Gillis hits Walker. You know, making free throws is toughness. That's a sign of toughness. And in a game like this, with you don't have a lot of margin for error, you got to take advantage of it. Nice. Five. Pulls it with the hand. Michigan State Spartans, this is a program victory if they can Snatch this one away from Purdue. Warrior, just a minute ago laying on top of us, now laying down a three. What tough defense by Blackwood. Physical against Boo. Boo trying to get inside. Martinelli to the rim, dunking over several bodies on the ground. Now watch Boo, he just take out a couple of Wisconsin badges there going to, to the hole. Being checked by him one on one. Here's A.J. Storm going past Martinelli. Count the bucket in the foul. Just a tough cover. Bowie on the run. In transition, Barnheiser gets his own miss. Ball not free, and Storm will come away with it. To Klesman. Back to Storm! The alley-oop for the Badgers! And a six-point lead! Hafey's really giving them a jolt on the defensive end coming over from Penn State. Battle picking up right where he left off last night. Boy, the quickness on that spin. Big time move, and what a shot for Jamison Battle to open this one here. Now Shannon oh! just putting Akpara on a poster. Shannon slam. Now this is just an NBA action where you're setting a pin down for the best athlete on the floor and letting him go make a play.
And if you're going to take on Felix Akpara, you better go to dunk it. Well, we thought there would be a lot of excitement in this game, and we're getting it early. This is the third time in a row that Illinois has gone to this Terrence Shannon pin down, and you've gotten buckets in there. DeBass missed that one. Danger. Wow! Puts him right in the bucket. The day we're looking for. The big fella flushing it. He says, this is my hometown. I thought Gabe Cups gave some really solid minutes, made some big shots last night, but they need their guards to, to really play well alongside what you know is their bread and butter and their bigs. Paco inside, powering it up. Counted in the foul. Baco staying with this play. Spin move initially. Jawan Gary on the block, but he never gave up on it. So three to shoot. Mbako lets it go and buries it. Tomanaga waiting. Five to shoot. Step back three. Oh! on the offensive glass. Got to clean up the turnovers, but I loved how we ended the half. Our guys got going. They did a great job playing on Selfish. Look, I know you got another 20. Break mass off the shot fake. Oh, what a pass. What a pass indeed. A little Magic Johnson action. Edy gets his first touch. They surround him. Four guys on him. <laughs> they want to stay at home, I think. You can't give up these open looks. Offensive rebound. Edy tosses it in. And the foul. That goes up. You get a body on him, but his size, his length, and great strength and concentration. The refs are calling it close here early, guys. So Marcus Ilber checks into the game. Layup goes. Kaufman Wren, excellent position. He had a great game earlier in the season. The roll by Crow and the finish with the left hand. And he got hit on the head. And and one opportunity for Stephen Crow. I like this kid. Nolan there. Winter in Lakeville, Minnesota native. Deep one. Score. How about Look that? it. For three. And just That's full of confidence. Great defense there. Nothing on that possession. Ten. Yeah. As you mentioned, Bird, uh, this kid can put it on the deck, but look at the range. He is playing confident. Crow trying to use a little more. Just step him up a little out of that box, ED. Feed it. ED, diagonal. Smith, take the spot on the outside. Gillis lines it up. Money. In both, three. Both guys left the ball. Versatile big who can fill up the stat sheet. Very mobile as we just saw. Next is dangerous. And he, and he can do that. Pick and pop. Perimeter like this. Rink mask is killing them. Yeah, they play relaxed, just like Fred Hoiberg. He has scored seven of their eight points. Shannon, back to back. Yes, sir. Wow. And he, he is special. He is. Give him some help because he's just too small. Rotation, catch and fire. He is a tough kid inside, too. He's a presence at the rim. Hoiberg, a young guy that the mask really feels it oh, today. It yeah. is rink mask takeover time. <laughs> Gary provides the lift with the bump. Which guard about him when they played? He said he was good, but I didn't realize he was this good. How about that bump by Gary, though? Sacrificing. I didn't say color, I said grow. <laughs> Toss in by Roger. Pretty again, another out of bounds. Well done to Shannon. Excellent chemistry there as well. Get into a set here with Williams. The jumper for Lawrence. Got it and a foul. How good is this kid? Coming off the bench. 2 0 lead for the Badgers. Hawkins, a key guy, I think, is picking pops. Got to make these threes if they're going to be big time. He's got it. A triple. And, and Bird, they're going side to side. I like this. In their earlier game, a little stagnant and a lot of isos. Crowell fouled out yesterday. 11 points, and he gets it to go reverse style. And that's so important. He's not afraid to take that deep one. Wisconsin up by three for the tie. Shannon! Uh, here he goes. Deep shot. And he's not afraid either to take no. the deep one. <laughs> Shannon showing his range right here. Oh, so hard to defend. You're watching Conference Championship Weekend. Shannon does. Got a, Shannon oh, cut. A pass. Gary A, the layup, no. Tapped outside. Here's A.J. Storr in the open floor. Euros denied. It's Hawkins. Do not go in there. Undeterred.
And a beautiful move, but a better block right there by Hawkins. Great timing. Didn't foul him. Wow. High level. High level oh. indeed. 